Hello again, doing another quick shitty video, and this time, it's about the Treasure Eye, a Garrett Electronics Incorporated product. This thing is old as sin, it might even be older than I am, early 90s, maybe mid 80s. So it might be older than me. I don't know. Anyways, uh, I got this at a garage sale for literally next to nothing. And lo and behold, it didn't work. One of the battery contacts was like not making contact with the batteries. And so that got me to dicking around with it. And having a look-see. Blah, blah, blah. Yada, yada, yada. And said something kind of peculiar about it. Like, so, the batteries, I expected them to be, like, I don't know, in parallel, or maybe they're in series, and they're tapping off the middle for a positive-negative rail for some op amps or something. But, uh, if we take a look here, so, Daddy Dumbass had to mark which ones were the negative rail, so, the left side, negative rail. I have continuity on, so, cool, and, nothing, what, oh, let's see, what, hmm, so the grounds are connected, but the positives are not, what, so, uh, where's my paper at, This was dumb, confusing to me. It made my brain hurt for a little bit. Oh, look, I even have the right one. So, it's upside down. All the electrons fell out. That's it. Ground, open, open. After a lot of dicking around, far too much dicking around, I figured out that they are doing one over in an the audio amp. And one is just going over to the regular circuitry, which is just going to be the two uh, inductors, basically, that are pretty much acting like a grid dip oscillator. Um, so, yeah, blah, 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 blah. And that goes over here, something. So whenever the metal crosses, sending the signal back to that, and it's beeping very annoyingly. I don't know why they did that. Why wouldn't they just... There has to be a reason. I'm just not smart enough to figure it out. Uh, anyway, so let's take a look-see here. Oh my god, this piece of shit phone. What's that? Uh, that's just a Ellen three five eight. All right, hold on. No, I don't know what that is. Hold on, I got to get my spectacles, testicles, wallet, and watch out. Uh, the right one over there is a five zero L zero five C. Whatever the fuck that is. However. That's just a 358. That is a LMC662. As well as that. Those are just uh, real rail CMOS amplifiers, I'm pretty sure. Mm. Sorry, I'm blind as a bat, and looking through this camera is not really that good. And that's a 34063, so that's one of those little uh, boost converter chips. And then they're super secret sauce. Anything over here? Anything? Anything? Just the pots. Forty sixteen. Is that an analog switch chip? Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. They have good caps in this. Jamacon. Ah. Oh. 
No. What's that? 86. Oh, LP 37. So, why did he use. Uh, I'm confused. They have one precision, two sea moss, um, jelly bean, jelly bean, jelly bean, and whatever the hell that is. Huh. Well, I'm sure it's built down to a cost. Every freaking thing is nowadays. But I was able to get this to work after I bent the contact back out a little bit. It uh, worked fine. I just bodged this in because I wanted to... Well, I wanted to run it when it wasn't hooked back up all the way. So, left it at that. And that's pretty much it. See you later.